So this is how the three boxes are defined. And now let me go ahead and give you the entire flow. So let's start from the number one step where you can see that mobile or web application user is searching to convert a particular text into the image. So second step is um, the Amplify, the React application is invoking your uh, endpoint, AWS API Gateway. And then AWS API Gateway is invoking the Lambda function by passing the text. And the Lambda function will uh, call to the SageMaker and it will pass the text and wait for the image to come. AWS SageMaker will create the image by inferencing through the model and then it will get back to the Lambda. So the Lambda function in the seventh step is it will go ahead and save the uh, image into the S3 bucket. Next, the Lambda function executes the eighth step where it will ask for the pre-signed image URL. So what is pre-signed image URL? It is a uh, direct URL that a uh, customer can click on it and download the image or it can um, your react application can use the pre-signed image URL to uh, render the image into the UI also. The ninth step is lambda function will get back uh, to the API gateway with the URL and then API gateway will get back the URL to the amplifier where your react application is hosted and react application will take that URL and then it will render the image for the end user to see it. So this is the overall flow. So what we will do is let's start uh, one by one writing the code. First, we will start uh, uh, creating a Lambda function which will invoke the SageMaker, which we already deployed. And then we will also uh, deploy API Gateway and we will test it out and then we will write the React application. And finally, we will complete our application. So stay tuned for the next videos.